At the farm, Justin saw one mother sheep with her two babies. How many sheep did Justin see in all? Boys and girls, I want you to read this story problem with me. Here we go. At the farm, Justin saw one mother sheep with her two babies. How many sheep did Justin see in all? Now, look back at this problem. Let's look at the important numbers. What are some numbers you see here? We see one mother, right, and two babies. So the numbers are one and two. One plus two equals three sheep. The one stands for the mother and the two stands for the two babies. Those are baby lambs, boys and girls. So Justin saw three sheep in all. A large dog was playing with his toy. Then a small dog wanted to play. How many dogs are playing? Remember, boys and girls, the word A means one. Boys and girls, let's take a close look at the story by reading it together. Here we go. A large dog was playing with his toy. Then a small dog wanted to play. How many dogs are playing? One plus one equals two dogs. Pat sees a mother duck and six ducklings in a lake. How many ducks does Pat see in all? Remember boys and girls to look for important numbers you are going to add to get your answer. Let's read the story together. Pat sees a mother duck and six ducklings in a lake. How many ducks does Pat see in all? Let's look for important numbers. Remember, the word A means one. So we have one mother duck, and the other number is six. So our two numbers are one and six. One mother duck plus six ducklings you add those two numbers together, one plus six equals seven. Kim saw one father horse, one baby horse, and one mother horse behind the fence. How many horses did Kim see? Read the sentence with me, boys and girls. Kim saw one father horse, one baby horse, and one mother horse behind the fence. How many horses did Kim see? Find the important numbers in this story problem. And we will add those numbers together to get the answer. One plus one plus one equals three horses. Michael saw a spotted shark, a gray shark, and a white shark at the aquarium. How many sharks did Michael see at the aquarium? Let's read. Michael saw a spotted shark, a gray shark, and a white shark at the aquarium. How many sharks did Michael see at the aquarium? Remember, boys and girls, when you see the word A, it means the number one. One plus one plus one equals 
three parts. At the farm, there is one turkey. <laughs> then, a goose joins the turkey. How many animals at the farm? Let's read. At the farm, there is one turkey. Then a goose joins the turkey. How many animals are at the farm? One plus one equals two animals. Betsy saw two black neck swans. One more black neck swan appeared. How many swans did Betsy see? Let's read. Betsy saw two black neck swans. One more black neck swan appeared. How many swans did Betsy see? Two plus one equals three swans. Here I am feeding two alligators. Later, another alligator joins the alligators in the swamp. How many alligators am I feeding? This is our last story problem, so read with me. Here I am feeding two alligators. Later, another alligator joins the alligators in the swamp. How many alligators am I feeding? Two plus one equals three alligators. Boys and girls, I am so proud of you. You went through all the story problems with me. The more you do, the easier it will become. Check out my English language arts and math book with DVDs. Take a rest break and let me encourage and teach your child and children like we are in a classroom. Just put in the DVD and select a lesson from the table of contents and off we go. English language arts and math books are generic. They can be used for first through third grade. All three learning styles are used so no child is 